Hello everybody, this is Nanduram and we are from Sonu Academy. Today we are going to discuss about Environmental Studies Class 4 CBSE Syllabus. Today's our topic is Too Much Water, Too Little Water. Children, in this lesson we are going to learn about Nalmanda village of Andhra Pradesh. Here the Suguna was reading her book. When she read someone at the door, she saw that there was a visitor from the city. Yes, Appa welcomed the guest. He told Selva to bring a cold drink from here. The guest said, I do not take cold drinks. I will just have a glass of water. Then Appa said, These days we are not getting water that is fit for drinking. It does not even look clean. It would be better if you do not drink this water. We do not have a choice. So we drink it. Appa said like that. Because in this Narmanda district, the people are suffering with a lot of water scarcity. For this, instead of water, they are using cool drinks to reduce their trust. Let us see another story of Maharashtra in Bazargon village. Yes, there was a big water park near Bazargon. One day, Rohan and Rina went with her parents to, to the water park. There are many water fountains. Rina said, look Rohan, there, there are so many rides in the water and look all these big ponds. Rohan said, yes, slash slash slash, both turned around. They saw a long thick water, shoes going zoom, zoom, zoom. Children were sliddling down a big tall slide and landing in water with a loud slash. Rohan got into a swim high above whoosh. Within a second, he had landed in water. Rina gave a strike of surprise. Just then, they heard a lot of noise and lot of voices from outside the park. As everyone ran towards the main gate, there was a crowd of people carrying empty buckets and pots. A small child carrying an empty bottle was stealing to his mother. Rohan's mother went to one of the women in the crowd. She asked, what is the matter? She asked. The woman replied angrily, You ask, what is the matter? Our wells have no water. We get our water only when the tankers come once in a week. Today even that has not come. And here there is so much of water everywhere. Just for you all to play and enjoy. Tell me, what should we do? So, people are standing and fighting to get the water from the water park. Let us see another story of Coffee Pride in Mumbai. This is a small story of Deepika in the Mumbai, a village of Coffee Pride. Yes. The lift stopped at the 26th floor. Deepak Klaus going in the lift. Today was a holiday in the school. Deepak had gone with his mother to Raizia's madam's house. His mother worked her there. The house was quiet and cool and shining clean. Rizia was reading a newspaper. He smiled when she saw Deepak. Is it is a holiday today? She asked. She switched on the TV and Deepak was soon lost in the world of cartoons. Rizia called up. Pushpa, it says in the newspaper that the gutter water has got mixed with the water in the drinking water pipes. In this area, it says that many people are at risk with diarrhea and vomitings because of this. Why don't you throw away the water that was filled yesterday? Put some fresh water to boil for drinking. Also to take home some boiled water for your family. Deepak was very happy to hear this. He thought at least today I will not have to stand in a queue for hours to get water for her home. It is really a holiday for me. Children, in this Mumbai area, where the Deepak lives in Kufi Parade, there is a lot of water scarcity. People are wait for hours and hours to get fresh drinking water. Because in these areas, the wells, ponds, lakes, they are totally dry and there is no water. So people are suffering a lot of water. Thank you. This is Nanduram and we are from Sonu Academy.